The suspension system in a vehicle is a critical component designed to absorb shocks, support the vehicle's weight, and ensure that the wheels maintain consistent contact with the road. It plays a crucial role in both vehicle handling and passenger comfort. The suspension system allows the vehicle to adapt to road conditions, making it possible to drive smoothly and safely on uneven surfaces, bumps, or curves. Its primary functions include absorbing shocks and vibrations, maintaining tire in contact with the road, improving vehicle stability, supporting the vehicle's weight, enhancing steering control, and providing load support. Now let's look at the components of the suspension system. Number 1 Springs We have four main types of springs, coil springs, leaf springs, torsion bars, air springs. Coil springs, these are the most common type of spring used in modern suspension systems, absorbing shock and supporting the vehicle's weight. Leaf springs, often used in heavy-duty vehicles, pickup trucks, rear axles and some SUVs, leaf springs consist of layered metal strips that provide flexibility and strength and are well suited to handle heavy loads. Torsion bars. These are bars that twist to provide resistance to the vehicle's weight and road shocks. Air springs. These use air pressure to provide a smooth ride, common in luxury vehicles and trucks. Number 2. Shock absorbers. These control the movement of the springs by damping the oscillations, bouncing, of the vehicle, ensuring a controlled ride. They convert kinetic energy into heat, which is then dissipated into the surrounding air, preventing the suspension from over-oscillating. Number 3. Struts. Struts are similar to shock absorbers but also serve as a structural part of the suspension system, providing structural support for the vehicle's upper suspension mounting point. They often integrate the spring and shock absorber into a single unit, commonly found in front suspension systems of many vehicles. Number 4. Control Arms. These are pivoted links that connect the wheel hub to the vehicle's frame or body. They allow the wheels to move vertically while maintaining proper alignment. Number 5. Ball Joints. Ball joints are used to connect the control arms to the steering knuckles, allowing the suspension to move up and down while also enabling steering movements. Number 6. Steering Knuckles. Steering knuckles connect the suspension components to the wheels, allowing the wheels to turn left or right in response to steering inputs. Number 7. Anti-roll bars. These bars are designed to reduce body roll during cornering by linking opposite wheels together. They improve the stability of the vehicle and reduce the chances of tipping over. Number 8. Bushings. Bushings are rubber or polyurethane components that reduce friction and vibrations between suspension parts, providing smoother motion and less wear. Number 9. Linkages. These are mechanical connections between different suspension components, such as between the shock absorbers, springs, and control arms. They help the suspension to work cohesively. Number 10. Wheel hub and bearings. The wheel hub holds the wheel and tire in place, while the bearings, press fit into the hub, allow the wheel to rotate smoothly without friction.